Hey, what's good, man? Hey, what's good? What's good, y'all, man? It is your boy, JP, man. And welcome back to the channel. If you are new, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Like the video for sure, because, you know, liking the video helps. Bro, did somebody pee over here? Like, bro, what is this, man? Like, I don't know. Excuse the pimple, man. Like, I don't know why. I guess I must have drank something too sugary. I don't know. But uh, welcome back to the channel, man. I hope you guys are having a great day so far, man. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, man. Uh, nice and beautiful. I wish I could flip the camera, but I can't without actually stopping the video. So I'm going to just flip my phone for y'all to see what I'm working with right now. You know, this is a chill spot right now. This is a chill spot. But, uh, so we're going to be talking about, for today's vid, man, we're going to be talking about pretty much, you know, following God's plan. God has a plan for everybody. You know what I'm saying? He has a plan for everybody. He has a plan for me. He has a plan for you. He has a plan for the person right next to you. He has a plan for everybody in that room that you are at right now. He has a plan for you, right? And when it comes to a Christian or when it, when it comes to anybody in general, but uh, for real, like seriously to the believers, right? At times we want to, you know, we want to pursue our own thing, right? We want to pursue, uh, let's just say, for an example, we want to be an NBA player, right? We want to be an NBA player, but that's something that God doesn't want you to do. You know what I'm saying? Now, basketball may be, invo may be involved, but it may not be your calling as far as his plan for your life, right? He has a plan for all of us. Uh, we all think at times, like, hey, like, I'm going to do me. You know what I'm saying? Like, forget his plan. Like, I'm going to do me, and God is just going to bless me. Yes, God blesses us, but if we don't follow his plan, his hands are off. He's not going to bless that. Now, if you follow his plan for your life, that's when he's always going to, you know, he's, gonna, he's always going to hand, he's always going to have a hand on that plan. Something that I had to snap out of was, yo, like, yeah, I started YouTube, you know what I'm saying? Um, of course, you know, God didn't tell me to do YouTube, but I did it. But I really truly believe that, hey, like, I'm blessed to have 24.1 thousand subscribers at the moment. And I truly believe he gave me a following for a reason. You know what I'm saying? To influence people around the world. They don't even have to be hoopers. You know, my channel is a lot about basketball because I love the game, right? But honestly, man, I really feel like God is going to be using me to develop a next generation of hoopers. You know what I'm saying? And I'm excited for that. I'm, I'm very, very excited for that. Um, like I was saying earlier... There was a point where I was like, God, like, I'm running this show. You know, I'm running this show. This is my show. You can tag along, you know what I'm saying? You can tag along. But that's not how it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be, you no, know, God, you take control of my life, and I'm going to follow. That's how it's supposed to be. You know, we're not supposed to have everything all figured out. You see, society says that we got to have things figured out. You know what I'm saying? You got to have a plan for so-and-so, so-and-so, so-and-so. Don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong with planning out your day. There's nothing wrong with, you know, having a, you know, having a thought in mind on what you want to do in life. But if God is, if you don't have God's approval for that, he will not bless that. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's people that work their butts off to get to a certain point in their life, Right? There's nothing wrong with that, you know, but they work their butt off. They work hard to get to where they want to be at. Meanwhile, if, you know, if you just follow God's plan, you know, he'll, he'll, he'll get you in there. He'll get you through that door. He will get you through that door. You know, it may take a little more time, but he will get you through that door. You know what I'm saying? You just got to be patient and believe because he will take you through that door. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to say it like this, but he'll he'll get you through that door much more easier, I should say. You'll be able to get through that door more easier than the other guy that had to, you know, grind for 20 hours a day talking about team no sleep. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, that's that's just nonsense, bro. You know, I understand, but bro, you gotta have sleep. You have to sleep if you want to, you know, 
be smart. You got to be able to, you know, you got to be able to see. You got to be able to hear. You got to be able to function. Your body's got to function. If you don't sleep, how's your body going to function? You know what I'm saying? So you got to have God first. If he, if his hands is off of it, then it's really mainly on you to get it done, which will make it a bit more harder. All right. I know, I know, you want the control. You want the control of your life. But that is why we have to live by, hey, I walk by faith and not by sight. Because God's going to provide. He told us, man, scripture. He said, hey, follow me, right? Follow me and I will provide. I will provide. I will guide you. I will lead you to the promised land. Some of you guys may be saying, how do I find out what's my plan? What does God have for me? That's when you got to be able to get in your word and listen to him. Spend time with him. Because if you're always running, 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 you know, you're not doing anything, but just, you know, you're constantly going. You're never going to have time to, you know, sit down, talk to the father, sit down, read your word, you know, and listen to him. If you're always running, you're never going to hear that voice. If you always got music playing, you're never going to hear that voice. So I just want to encourage you guys. There's nothing wrong with listening to music. There's nothing wrong with listening to podcasts. There's nothing wrong with watching movies, whatever the case is, right? There's nothing wrong with that. But there comes a point in time where you have to, you know, get in your word on a daily basis. Get in your word and spend time with the Father. He will point you out. He will lead you to the direction to where you are called to be. If you don't know your calling, he knows it. You want to know something? God knows what you're going to do before you even do it. God knows your future. God knows who you really, really are. He knows it. So why try to, you know, find it within yourself when you could just, you know, follow God and he will show you the way. He will lead the way. I just wanted to state that, man. I'm praying that you guys will, you know, walk by faith and not by sight and just give God full control. Like I stated, I know you want that control. I know you do. I know it could be scary at times, man, just walking by faith, not knowing, you know, what will happen in life. But like he stated, man, cast all your fears, your anxiety, cast it all to him. And he will give you that comfort because he loves you so much. Man, like, am I missing anything else? Um, man, it's a beautiful day, man. It's a beautiful day, man. But um, am I missing anything? Man, I got a feeling, bro. The minute I, the minute I hit end on this video, I'm gonna be like, I should have added that. But I think I'm gonna just conclude the video, man. Just really take consideration on what i you know spoke um i'm praying that you guys will continue to follow god man because he knows you he knows your plan so if he knows your plan go after god man because he loves you and he knows that he wants you to do great and you will do great things all right i'm gonna catch y'all man it's your boy jp man in the cut i appreciate y'all man new video coming soon I love y'all, man. Till next time.